Okay, so this app is called Mosaic HD, and um, this is uh, a really cool um, creative app. Lots of things. So let's open it up and look at about. Um, this game will fascinate players as young as two and help them improve dexterity, color recognition, memory, and imagination and creativity, all while having fun. I'll explain the rest of the instructions on there. We've got two different things here, your masterpiece and play with card. Uh, so let's go ahead and open it up on, on play with card. Uh, when we do this, we can just want to show you this we can turn the music down and we will you can turn the sound effects up and down but when we do this we have so we have two sizes large and small let's start off by looking sorry small and big let's start off by looking at the small pictures um, and what it is you have a picture here that you are asked to create so let's click on the Valentine and uh, I've already done this one before, so it tells me what my best score is, or it has been in the past. And um, when you click play, you get a blank screen, you get a picture in the top left of the, of the uh, card, and you have to recreate that. Now, what you do is you select a color, just by doing this. These, are, these look absolutely beautiful on the iPad. Um, and you then put that in place, just by touching one of the holes. Uh, now, as you move your finger all over the screen, you'll see they'll go into place. To remove them, you basically just touch the ones you've already put in, and they will they will disappear. Um, let's go back out and come back in, so I don't have to do all that for you. But let's show you. Go back on the heart again. We'll click play. And another way to do this is to turn the help on, okay? So now you've got the help on, you've got an outline of the shape or the mosaic that you're trying to create and it shows you what colored dots go in what places. So we've got the red dot highlighted. You can do it one by one if you want to or the child wants to. You can also very, very coolly run your finger over the shapes like that. Go on to the next color. And we finish it off and we get a congratulations we get a time that it took us now we can continue drawing and play with that if we want to change the colors uh, we can share it via email or you can even post it to your Facebook page which is kind of cool uh, but if you do continue drawing uh, what can what happens is you basically um, can just play around with uh, you know with the colors and do whatever you like so so things like that, you just be careful, my fingers are a little big, but be careful not to uh, touch the ones you put in. And then you can, uh, can change it. You can clear it, you can save it, and you can share it. If you save it, um, it gets saved to your gallery. Um, if you clear it, it will clear the screen and you can start all over again. So let's go back out. Here's my gallery. There's the things I saved so far when I was playing around. And let's go on to um, this one again and look at the smaller ones. So these are a little bit more complex, obviously, because they're, they're uh, larger pictures with smaller beads. And the same sort of thing uh, you get. You can have it with no help, or you can have it with help. I'm afraid I need the help. Um, and then you just go along and do this. And you don't have to. Um, it's only going to tell you you're correct if you follow the color scheme. Uh, but you don't have to follow the color schemes. For example, you can you can put red in here where they're not supposed to be, and they'll flash, telling you that they, those colors are incorrect. Um, and then go ahead and just take them out. Um, so you finish that off with the blues. You go up to purple over here, and it 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 works very well. It's um, it is sensitive, but it's not too sensitive, in that you don't have to be so precise and worry about going over the other other dots. We've got one wrong up there, we'll get rid of that, and we're complete. So we uh, 
we'll go back out of this, back to the menu, and let's go into your masterpiece. Now your masterpiece is basically where you have the creativity to do whatever you want. You can go in with the large ones and, um, you know, create whatever it is you want to create. Uh, have a good game of tic-tac-toe if you want while you while you're on there in a, some strange sort of way. Uh, you can always clear that, you can go back out and, and put it on the smaller side of things um, and then you have a lot more a um, lot more creativity that you can you can do here. So you can create a, a, a rainbow if you want to. I think you get the idea. Um, but it works very very well. Uh, the music um, like I said, can be turned all the way down, so you don't have to listen to that. Sound effects are kind of cool. The way that the uh, the dots, the pegs go in there, and uh, and so on. And these are the pins that you use here. Anyway, um, that's it. That was called Mosaic HD, and uh, it's a really cool.